Hi everybody, Eric Bagley, Lloyd's Automotive. 1970 Ford Mustang Mach 1, part two. Continuation of the series that we've already started. I will put a link in the description below of part one of the project uh, that we're doing. So where we'd kind of left off, so we did kind of overview the vehicle and had looked it over. Uh, we looked it over, continued further uh, in the coming days after that, talked to our customer. Uh, one of the things that it uh, needs is on the driver's front uh, strut tower uh, side uh, apron piece, uh, the uh, it was all rusted out and somebody had kind of put a paneling on there that was really thin and it's uh, not a good situation and uh, pretty dangerous because it's a structural portion of the vehicle. So our customer is having uh, that fixed uh, and also going to have a core support put in it. Uh, we're going to tow it over to the body shop to have that work done, but we're going to do the mechanical side of things. And uh, one of the things that we're going to do is uh, remove the engine and transmission on the vehicle. Uh, going to reseal the uh, engine kind of an external reseal on it, I'll replace the carburetor, kind of freshen some things up around it. And uh, at the body shop, uh, they're gonna put the uh, that driver's uh, uh, strut uh, tower apron piece on it and the core support in it, and then also clean up the uh, uh, engine bay area and going to uh, paint that as well. And then we're gonna, when we get it back, uh, then we'll put the engine and transmission back in it. It's going to be much easier for them to uh, do the body uh, repair on it with those items removed. Uh, we're also going to uh, reseal the uh, rear differential on it uh, as well and do some electrical repairs to it. Uh, so in this video here, we're going to be removing the engine and transmission uh, and then uh, we'll uh, go from there. So by removing the engine and transmission, it's going to make it a lot easier uh, for the body shop in order to uh, take that uh, apron piece off of the uh, vehicle because it's kind of in the way with that in there so we're going to get that out also by having that out we can do the reseal on it and do the other work we're going to do to it um, out of the vehicle it took eight weeks the uh, parts were back ordered so we wanted to get the uh, body panels here first uh, before we kind of got too uh, far into things and so we got the this is a strut uh, apron piece. You can see that the spring and everything is gonna fit up in here. And this is where it was all rusted out is in this area uh, where your control arm bolts in here on the uh, vehicle. And then we got the core support uh, in the box underneath this piece here. So now that we have the uh, panels here, it's going next week into the uh, body shop uh, so they can get their end of it uh, done. But we gotta get the engine and transmission out uh, so it's prepped and ready for them to make it easier for them on doing their repairs. When we do these projects here, it's very important to protect the vehicle. Uh, so we have lots of fender covers on here all the way around uh, to protect the vehicle. We're also going to Ziploc bag up all the bolts as we take them off and label what they go to. And we're going to put everything all by itself in a separate cart uh, when you have projects like this, we don't know how long it's going to be at the body shop. And I assume it's going to take a couple weeks there. Uh, we don't want to be losing anything. We take lots of pictures of the uh, engine and how everything was originally put together on it uh, to give us a reference point of what it looked like uh, before we start working on it. All right, so let's get underway here and uh, let's uh, get this engine out. Here's what I like Laying on the beach with sunlight in my eyes Laughing with my friends under the sky Following our hearts with them we take a ride Wherever I always try to let my spirit fly Fly away That's the only way to get that high High Always If you look at the trouble To this cameraman. Not gonna lie, sometimes when I'm whoa, shit. We'll leave that out. <laughs> yes. Okay, so stop the thing.
Here's what I like Jumping from a roof that is almost too high Laying on the grass, I close my eyes Playing my guitar to my fingers and numb oh, I always try to let my spirit fly The hood is a bounces back and forth coming down the lift. <laughs> shimmy, 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 yeah.
for some dollars to keep me going I try to act like a superstar Get tattoos without colors In a place where it's showing And I, 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 I Blew my cash on drinks Not to mention this new ink Yes, I, I, I Wanna go crazy now Gonna make this all count Feeling like a rock star Cause tonight One of it. <laughs> the shenanigans. You know what I really have to do now is take the transmission out. By itself. Because I can't one piece it, and the transmission comes out fairly easily, especially at this point. Yeah. I don't know if it'll fit between the exhaust, but that's not the end gonna of the come, world. It's going to come down. And like, literally, it doesn't go back that far. Because back maybe an inch, it'll fit.
got time, but no money. But there ain't nobody stopping us. We got bills, but no dollars. But now we don't really give up. No, we don't really give up. Living for the ray of light. Life can be beautiful. Life can be beautiful. Going all the way to night. Making it beautiful. Acting like there's no tomorrow. Acting like there's no tomorrow. Acting like there's no tomorrow. I wish I could work that fast. That would be pretty amazing. So we got the engine out, got it on the uh, engine stand here. And we'll let you see uh, the body damage that's on the uh, vehicle uh, here in just a sec. We got the apron piece here. And that's the whole piece that's gonna get replaced and you can see right down here where somebody put some patch panels in. And you see the big cracks going up the sides. And that's why we're replacing that piece here. Now, if you look at the other side, it doesn't look that same way. Everything looks in much better condition. So this radiator core support piece here, we're gonna replace as well. And if you look down here, you can see where somebody has put a patch panel in there uh, trying to uh, fix that and definitely not the uh, prettiest of welds. So definitely needs to be replaced. So we're gonna replace the whole entire piece. We appreciate you watching this video. Don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe for continued content posted weekly. Stay tuned for additional parts in the series on the 1970 Ford Mustang restoration project that we are doing.